So it's a three bedroom, two bath. Linda Kellogg is retired, looking to move into a smaller home, and she's been thinking about it for almost 10 months. But she's nervous about the tax implications. Under current law, seniors who move can lose their property tax protection and be hit with a substantial moving penalty. Kellogg says relocating from Riverside to L.A. could cost her almost $500 more a month in taxes. But Proposition 5 would change that. It would allow homeowners 55 or older, disabled or affected by a natural disaster, to transfer their tax assessment to their new home with a possible adjustment, no matter the home's market value, the new home's location in the state, or the buyer's number of moves. We find that many Californians, tens of thousands actually, that are 55 and older, are frozen in place. Steve White is president of the California Association of Realtors, and he says passing Prop 5 would help ease the state housing crisis by convincing more seniors to sell. They're telling me that they're afraid because they're afraid to outlive their money. And so many of them feel that um, they cannot move because of the uncertainty of how long they're going to live and how much money they're going to have. Right now, the property tax transfer law varies throughout the state. It's only in effect in 10 of 58 counties. We have a housing crisis. Political scientist Fernando Guerra agrees there's a shortage of single-family homes, but he doesn't think Prop 5 will help. The California Teachers Association opposes the plan, saying it's going to take state tax money that could be used for improving schools and roads and public safety. People are not going to make a decision to move based on this. Why give away $2 billion, take it in away from schools, from public safety. Supporters say passing Prop 5 would encourage people to move and get thousands more homes on the market. Critics say it will put more money in the pockets of a select few and cost the state billions of dollars. Sandra Mitchell, CBS 2 News.